Greetings, YouTube, and welcome to a new video series I'm starting today on this day, which is a recorded day, so it's back in time. Today we are starting Nerf Gun Reviews, and I'm starting off with a very simple one. This one is called the Strong Arm. That's a very fancy name for just a six bullet revolver. And what the Strong Arm does is there's a air compressor like in this area of the gun because I dissected it earlier. And you pull this back and then that will bring out the bullet which is in here. And you push this button every single time and this will let you unload and reload your revolver. Now, and there will be a video segment in here somewhere for me shooting it earlier. Now, the thing with the strong arm is that they've made several versions of this, and I have one of them right here. This one's called the Rev 6. This is one of the earlier versions of it, and as you can see, I like. I had some fun with it. I gave it two colors when I took it apart. What This is the older version. Same basic design. You push the button on the side and the barrel comes out and you pull back and that fires the bullet. But this one is actually heavier and doesn't shoot as far as this one does. So this one's both lighter and shoots further. Now, this is supposed to shoot I think up to 75 feet. Now, it might be different now if you go out and buy one, because I bought this a while ago. But uh, this gun I'm holding right here no longer shoots up to 75 feet. And the thing with that is they say on the box for their Nerf guns now that they recommend that when you keep your guns in storage, not to have the bullets in the actual gun when you keep it in storage for a long period of time because apparently that will make your gun no longer shoot at its maximum abilities and I did not know that so I keep it I've kept its bullets in there for a while and it's I've had like duds come out of it so that is disappointing but I think all the nerf guns now where they have that effect where the bullets are inside barrels like this they have that little sticker on there that says don't if you're very serious about nerf guns don't put the bullets in there when you keep it in storage that's my only complaint about this is actually it's a it's very well sized for anyone's hand it I've seen cosplayers use this specific gun because what you can do is if you see on the side this is the side with all the screws on there. And I don't know how well you can tell, but there's a line that goes straight down the gun. And what you can do is you can take it apart into two pieces. And once you have it, once you have the two shells in your hand, you can spray paint those two shells and then color this very basic revolver to whatever you're cosplaying as. And I've seen few people do that. I've no I think I've seen some Bioshock cosplays do that for Booker. And that is our basic review for the Nerf Strong Arm. This is probably one of my favorite guns because it's so, just so simple. And so, not really unique, but a lot, a lot of worldly purposes for a gun like this. Thank you for tuning in to this video. I will be doing more of these in the future as time goes on because I have a big pile of them over here. And if you would like to see more of them, be sure to hit the subscribe button. Until then, I will see you in another universe.